Hey there friends, how's it going? Great news, they're shooting me into outer space. Uh, slightly less great news, I'm very uncoordinated. I found this game called Heavenly Bodies, which puts you in the shoes of an astronaut that just cannot control their limbs, has zero hand-eye coordination, but is still expected to carry out the duties of an astronaut. This gets really weird and really frustrating, but I'd rather show you instead, so stick around on our little space adventure. Uh, let's get right to it. Oh, I'm already playing. Look, I'm waving. I'm so happy to be in space. I'm waving at both my hands. Way, yes. Why would they send this person to space? So all we gotta do is open the hatch. Oh, yeah, that's all we have to do. This is just gonna go great, isn't it? How did I end up up here? Oh, it's gonna be hard with no gravity. Okay. Okay, wait, we'll just... There, there we go. Oh, no! Yeah, this is gonna be a frustrating experience. Okay, I'm through. I'm upside down. Going with the Superman strategy. I'm just pointing my hands the way I want to go. I can tuck my legs. Oh, yes, look at that. <laughs> Doesn't really put too much effort into that. But I can use that to boost off things, right? Like this. Ugh. Yeah, just like that. Wait, I just went black and white. Am I dying? I feel like I'm dying, <laughs> but I feel like this was meant to happen. You will need to configure internal power systems and reorientate the external solar array. I can't even reorientate my body. Even in the cutscene, I'm not there. I fell out of it. I'm stuck in this tiny gap. This is major Kevin to ground control, and I'm feeling very stuck. Oh, there we go. I just managed to kind of roll out of it. <laughs> yes. Okay, I got my mission. Now you give me the operation manual when I'm all ready in space. I need to turn a lever and then hit three buttons and then plug something in. Oh, there's my lever, I think. Oh, now this is graceful. Oh, I wish I hit that. Oh, <laughs> I got all the buttons at least. <laughs> Just smacked my head off them. Come on. <laughs> His whole body's vibrating. Come on. <laughs> yes. Come on. No, it's off. Yes. Yes. All right. Now I just need to plug this in. Which should be easy, right? This will be uh, the easiest of the tasks. I'm so angry to have my own space. Normally, I think that would be a great thing. But right now, I just want i want a bit of help. <gasps> I nearly have it. No, no, pull me back. My new strategy is like a weird sort of swimming <laughs> where I just kind of wiggle my arm in the direction I want to go. Come on, go in. There we go. We got it. I assume I get an Uber back home now or is there more? Oh, I need to find a way into the airlock and then unwind the folded solar panel. I'm guessing this is for one of them, the airlock? I'll just push this lever with my face, <laughs> just like I do in real life. That way, no fingerprints. Just a lot of saliva. Yes! Okay, now gracefully swim. You see, I'm getting the hang of this, right? It, it, oh, maybe not. <laughs> it kind of looks like I'm getting the hang of it, but then I start banging into walls again. Oh, I took a picture of something. <laughs> they do say take a picture, it'll last longer, and I'm pretty sure that picture will last longer than this guy. I don't think he's even coordinated enough to feed himself up here. Come on, man, you got that power. <laughs> I love how his arms start, like, shaking when he can't push the lever. Yes! Oh! Okay, maybe that was too strong. Do I need to chase this lever or will I, you know what? If you love something, let it go. And boy, do I love that lever. I'm gonna grab the sparky parrots. Come on, I'm trying to inch my way to the door. Yes, we've done it. What is this? A crowbar? Excellent, I'm armed. Oh, what's this? Oh, my cheese. If only I weren't lactose intolerant. Ooh, I found this as well. I think this was on the, the lever thing, the box. It showed a picture of a spanner, right? Oh no, I'm gonna have to go get that lever, aren't I? Oh, I can rotate the camera? I guess that's... Yeah, that is handy, actually. That makes it easier. It... Which isn't saying much. <laughs> yeah, it's not saying much at all. I'm going backwards now. It's harder when I'm grabbing things. Plus, there's all this cheese floating everywhere now. This is good. This is a good motion. Not sure I like that salute, but it's fine for now. Yeah. Uh, am I fixing something? I, I have no idea. Okay, yes, I fixed it. Oh no, my little feet. <laughs> Somebody save my feet. My career goal after astronaut is only fans foot model. These are the only two things I got going for me. Because clearly I'm not a very good astronaut. Yes. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna grab this to tether myself. I'm guessing I can't let go of this, right? Because I'll just drift off into space. Oh, there we go. All right, I'm I'm hooked on. Okay, this this doesn't look big enough to support my weight. There's a lot of wobble there. That's okay, because I'm performing my signature move as opposed to my normal move that I don't know what I'm doing. This is the I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm upside down. Just kick it. That'd be so much easier. Oh, you can't kick it, can you? 
Oh, God, I know they say slow and steady, but there's nothing steady about this. I'm going backwards. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, oh, no. Okay, it's becoming untethered. Oh, don't ask me how I got into this situation. Just send help. Oh, man, I can't turn it. Oh, there we go. Yes. I'm folding or unfolding, I'm not sure, but I'm moving something. Yes, finally. Oh, my first day is a tough day at the job. This is such a graceful shot and then my very ungraceful pose. Should I close the door after me to like keep the bills down? Uh, you know what? It'll be fine, I'm sure. NASA has deep pockets. At the start, I thought I might be with the Irish Space Agency, but then I wouldn't have made it. I'd be dead. Our record so far is 14 feet. We're hoping that Mr. Fitzgerald can throw the fella higher next time. Uh oh. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> It looks like he got knocked unconscious, but then again, he always kind of looks like that. Can I please detach myself? Thank you. That thing was driving me mad. It just pulls you down. Okay, where to now? What's my next goal? Report to mission control. Oh, I have another mission. Where is mission control? Oh, it's over there. All right, so this is where you're keeping all the control. Can I have some? Because I feel like I have no control right now. Case in point, I'm stuck in a suitcase and just flailing my arms around. I've lost all my cheese also. That was probably my whole food supply for the time I'm up here. Oh, I found one more piece. I wonder, can I eat the cheese? Now I'm trying to package myself up. Okay, excellent. I have got my next mission. Well, hold on. I've almost got it. There we go. I've got it. Or is this just some clean paper? Maybe I should answer the phone. Gotcha. Reporting in. It took me 18 minutes to do the first task, and I don't feel like I had to go very far. <laughs> this is going to be so painful. Now I need to bring the data tower online. Does anything on this ship actually work? I'm including me in that. Calibrate antenna one, two, and three, and then calibrate the main dish. What does that involve? Cable types, data is blue, power is red. All right, I'm doing a, a task from Among Us. Imagine if this guy was Among Us. <laughs> I'd be very scared. I'm trying to point it to pick up the Irish television shows. I want to see what's on TG Car. Oh, I was just air swimming and I got the blue one in. Nice. Oh, I'm getting some signal here. I think I'm detecting alien life. I love how his hand is next to his ear like he's going, wait for it. I hear something. What is it? Aliens I'm hearing? <laughs> oh, I just plugged out the data cord by accident. Uh, is that okay? Am I meant to do that? Oh, I can just hold on to this thing now. At least it keeps me on track. But I have a feeling this isn't like this to make my life easier. <laughs> just hazarding a guess with how this game is going so far. <laughs> Yes! It just kind of fell in there. One minute it was in my ass and the next minute it was there. I don't know what this is doing. Is this meant to be like moving the satellite or? Oh wait, I think that yellow string is stopping it. Okay, I'm gonna have to go remove that, aren't I? <laughs> For God's sake. Oh no, okay, I gotta be really careful here because unlike the satellite, I am not tethered. He doesn't care though. He's the clumsiest person on earth. Well, he was <laughs> and he just doesn't care. Uh-oh, 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 oh, oh, okay, I got on. Oh, that was bad. That could have been the end. Wait a second, what's going on here? There's loads of power lines just, like, not plugged in. What does this do? I feel like I shouldn't be pulling it out if I don't know what it does, but yet here we are. There was a hatch! Oh, for God's sake! Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, 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 Wait, no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Dude, don't go on me. Don't go on me. Hold on. We can fix this. We really can. Okay, I'm losing I'm losing confidence. Stop. This way. We just need to land swim, right? Land swim. There you go. Oh, we got up to like 99 point something. I wonder was it 100 and it would have cut us off. I got an achievement from recovering from a near-death experience. Well, you can call that near-death, but you can't call it recovering because I don't know where I am. Oh, wait. I landed on a satellite. Oh, maybe I have to fix this one. I think I do. I think I have to bring it down to touch here. Oh, I'm a genius. It was all calculated out, really. I was just doing that to panic you. I totally had that under control. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I, I like, literally, hold on to something, please. Okay, like a bird. Yeah, just flap. Gracefully like a bird. Yeah, smack into the window just like a bird. Looks like he's chilling just his hands behind his head, but we are not chilling. I need to get back in there. Oh, the one benefit of being out in space is, well, there's a lot of space. It's not as awkward as being in these little tunnels, but it's also terrifying. Just adjusting the satellite. I'm not sure which way it should be, so I'm just kind of winging it, as I'm sure you've already guessed. Oh, 
I hear a noise. Okay, great. It's going sort of blue. Oh, there's even a signal meter. I'm an idiot. Well, that's evident from everything we've done so far, but just confirming it is all. It's nice to know. Uh, this little alien face on the TV, I'm a little bit worried about it. Okay, we'll close this hatch and try to figure this out, because I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do over in this point. Like, it's frustrating to get around, but it's also a puzzle game. I just realized that even this part, I'm supposed to have a tether, right? Like, I could use that as my tether? I'll just unhook it for now and then see if I can move this whole beam like I wanted to. I'll support my whole body weight with this wire. I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm an astronaut. I know what I'm doing. Okay. All right. It is moving. That is a good thing. I think. Oh, yeah, so that's opening here now uh, over to this side. It'll come all the way around. Excellent. And then we can slide the thing onward. No, 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 don't. No, no, come back. Come back. <laughs> Please come back. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, there. I got it. Oh, no, it closed on the wire. The, the fog is stuck outside the ship. All right, fine. I'll open it again. I hope no one's looking at me through a telescope. This would be very embarrassing. Oh no, it's getting away from me again. Whew. Okay, and, and look, I even floated towards the wire totally intentionally. Now I'll just have to plug this in. Look how well this is going. Maybe I'm getting good at this. Or maybe it was just an accident. I think it's more likely to be the second. But I did get it plugged in pretty easily. So I don't know, maybe I am getting good at this, which is kind of sad. I'd rather be good at something else. Oh, I'm getting a bit of rhythm going now. That was nice movement right there. Houston, I am once again floating untethered outside of the spacecraft. Yes, excellent. All right, have I done them all? Yes, I've done them all. Even though I made it way harder than it had to be. Now calibrate the main dish. Which is the main dish, I wonder? It's actually kind of handy because I'm pretty sure that I would have had to adjust that one. But I already pulled out the antenna earlier when I was kind of floundering around. I'm guessing this is the main one because the thing seems to be able to extend a bit more. Yeah, there must be something out there. I'm going to untether that. <laughs> I don't know what that sound was. I think perhaps a space monster. Are space monsters real? I don't know. They didn't tell me much before I left, as you can see. Oh, God. Watch the power cord. Don't snap on the power cord. No, 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 no. Hold on. Let me get that power cord. Oh, okay. Phew. I'm getting confused which hand is which. Um, Left? Oh, yeah. Okay. I do know my left and right. In fact, that's all they asked me before I came up here. I gotta detach more stuff. Oh, I can zoom out. All right, yeah, I think the main satellite is ahead. Oh, no, I think the lead just plugged out. Oh, wait, maybe the lead was supposed to plug out. That was very dangerous. I just ripped it out of the extension. I don't know if I had to replay this. I think my soul would just crawl into a hole and die. Like you may as well shoot me off into space IRL. I do this weird dance when I need to move the TV. <laughs> just kind of nudge it along. I imagine them watching me at base like, look at him. God, he's good at what he does. I appreciate that whoever was up here last is energy conscious, but did they really need to disconnect all of the plugs? This is what my mom does in my house. She goes around unplugging all of my stuff. Come on, get lucky. This is exactly what it's like to plug in a HDMI behind the television. But it worked. I think this is the part of the game where they first wanted me to go untethered now that I look at it. What can I say? I don't play by the rules. Oh, this is just a loose cord. Oh, now I'm just cleaning up after the last person. Oh no, I do seem to be uh, floating away though. Okay, I'll tie that cord onto myself just in case I need it. Plus, I can always find my way back if I get lost by a few feet. Come on, Tom. You can do it! Come on, Tom! Use all of your force! God, you're gonna feel that arm in the morning. Whoa, look at the power of Tom! I think it's the wrong way though, Tom, so you're gonna have to bring it back. It's working though, he's so strong! I know there's no gravity, but still, we gotta hype up Tom. I'm Tom's hype beast. No, wait, that signal's not right either. Wait, where are we meant to be pointing? Oh, we're gonna have to extend it, aren't we? Oh, that's what we're gonna have to do. Okay, I'm going untethered. <laughs> Oh, I immediately smacked myself in the head. I'd like to think that this is just Tom's excuse, having this tether just going, yeah, you only said that I should be tethered. You didn't say I should be tethered to a part of the, the, the aircraft, the, the spacecraft, the satellite. I don't know what I'm on. Come on, Tom. Use your dance. Oh, the dance is working. Yeah, go on. Come on, Tom. You can do this. Come on. This looks really wrong. Okay, I think this is working. Yes. Okay, perfect. 
Excellent. I think it's turned on. Oh no. Oh no. No, Tom. Tom, that tether isn't on to anything. No. No, I can't repeat this. I can't. Okay, phew. I'm guessing I need to take it down this way, right? Oh, it's getting closer. Oh, I'm getting further. Oh, oh, oh come on. Yes, we're fine. Getting a little bit better at uh, air swimming. I mean that like air guitar, by the way, before everyone starts calling me an idiot. But feel free to call me an idiot for anything else in the video. Oh, thank goodness it's done. It's, oh my god, look how far I've traveled. <laughs> it looks so much worse when you show it like that. Report to mission control. Oh, do I have to crawl all the way back? Well, if that's the case, I'm just swimming. I think I'm actually confident enough to do this. Oh, all right, wait. Okay. Yep. You know what? I'm drifting in the right way, so I'll just, I'll just drift. You know, nothing wrong with a bit of coasting. Unless you hit into your spacecraft. Ow, my leg. All right, no, we're fine. I'm just... Slightly veering off course. That's okay. Oh, 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 there we go. Wait, where, where am I going? Is it in this one? I just hit my head off that satellite and bumped it off course, but I'm sure it's still getting reception. It's fine. And this is where I need to be. I need to detach this thing. It's just getting in the way now. <laughs> I think I'm confident enough now anyway. Me and Tom, we've got a, we got a thing going. We're bonding. Oh. Sometimes I do smack his head off things, though. But he likes it. It's it's like a, a playful thing we do. Almost there. Hold on. <laughs> I'm just adjusting my body is all. Hold on. All right, you're going to have to speak up. I'm wearing a spacesuit. It took me 33 minutes to do that one. Man, <laughs> this is so much of my life <laughs> spent out here with Tom. Stage three is called vision. I'm guessing it's because Tom can't actually see and we need to go find him spectacles. It would explain a lot why he's just feeling his way around. You must assemble the telescope from modular components. Really? <laughs> Reasonable precision and stability will be required. Then why did you ask me? <sighs> well, here we are again. It's always such a pleasure. Operations manual. Let's see. Oof. Oh my god, what is this? I've got to use some crane thing? Repair the crane arms using the ratchet. Assemble the space telescope. Attach the following components. Solar panels, receiver, processor. Oh dear lord. I'm just gonna let Tom have a little bit of a rest here. <laughs> just relax, he needs it, he's earned it. Okay, my first question is, is this full of cheese? Um, no, it's not. Okay, is that fireworks? What an excellent idea. Uh, but my, my first question was actually going to be, where do I go? Yes! These can be used to get around- Oh god! Oh my head! Oh no! Oh I'm stuck! Somebody help me! Oh, phew! Are they a one-use thing? Uh, that might be for the best. Honestly, levers are one of like the hardest things in this game. <laughs> oh, I think it's just not powered or something. Oh, and even he can't open the doors, so no, we're not going this way. So I'm looking for a crane arm. Where would I be if I were a crane arm? <gasps> Probably on a crane! Okay, I, I know where I could go. Oh, wait. I didn't know I could actually sit down, but I guess those are the crane arms, right? Well, I'm gonna need a wrench then. I'm not looking forward to controlling this thing, just FYI. I'm upside down in the chair and I can't get out. I'm stuck. My arms are lodged. Can I just get this suitcase out of here? Can I throw it out? I don't care if it belongs to one of the other astronauts. They left this place in a state anyway. They don't deserve their luggage and they certainly don't deserve their cheese. There we go. <laughs> Did the little kick out the door. I was a about to throw this off into space. Uh oh, what did I just do? Oh, my head! My head! No, hold on, don't! Don't go! I need my head, I use that sometimes. Um, I do have a slight problem in that now I think the thing I need is locked on the other side. But yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna throw this thing out into space like if my first instinct told me. I'm gonna put that away also. Yes! Okay, I think I got it. I just don't hit it again. I was really worried I had broken the game there. It would be very on brand. Me and Tom have that in common. We break a lot of stuff. Hey guys, I have an idea. I'm gonna design the door and I'm gonna make it in the most awkward way possible, okay? That didn't sound so uh, all good to you guys at NASA, yeah? Oh, got it, got it. Oh, oh, my head. No, the tool! The tool is stuck in the door. And I'm talking about the, the ratchet, not me, before you say anything like that. Mm, come on, <laughs> come through. Yes, I got it. Through pure stubbornness. 
I don't even know if this is the tool. Uh, before I obsess about it, I should probably find out. Now it doesn't look like it. Now that I look at the manual, it doesn't look like a ratchet very much. I mean, it, it kind of did. Oh, I do think I had to get it through here, though, because look at those little stumps on that main thingy. <laughs> I know what all these things are called. I'm just saving time. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure that bit that I was going to hurl into space is missing off that thingy as well. That big chunk missing. Okay, well... I put it somewhere. <laughs> Let's hope that worked. Oh, I did put on the receiver. <laughs> Excellent. Well, I did something useful, everyone, even if it was by accident. Uh-oh. Oh, various parts of my body are in danger. Okay, phew. Oh, just about. Oh, no, I'm just seeing the part of the ship that's drifting towards the door. Oh, no, I banged off it a while ago, but I didn't think it would make an impact. Oh, <laughs> I hope that doesn't make it out. No, I think... I think it's good. I'm just gonna leave it there and I'll go around and come in that door because I think I've realized that the ratchets are actually attached to the lever already. Um, I, I may be wrong. I, I think I was wrong. <laughs> There's nothing here. Damn it. All right, well, I found the other solar panel I need, so that's good. I'm taking the solar panel the wrong way, so that's not good. I'm just kind of bumping into it to move it around now. It's a little bit easier sometimes. I'm sure it's not fragile. These things are built to last. Hmm, I seem to have wedged it in the tunnel that I need to get through. How did I do that? Okay, be free. Yes, I'll... Find you later. Oh no, it's coming back after all my work. All right, well, whatever. I need to find this ratchet. I'm just wondering, is it in one of these cases that I left at the start? But then I just took off because I had a rocket on me. Oh, oh, okay. Well, I'm leaving that room now, but uh, I don't think it was there anyway. Oh, it was in the other side. Thank you, rocket. We've gone from sworn enemies to best friends. I'm sorry. I'm just smacking it off every piece of machinery that I go by. <laughs> yeah, the solar panel went back to basically exactly where I started it. And now even worse, because I've kicked it away. But you know what? I don't care. I love the ratchet. I also need to save that part from going out. But I don't care. I, I love the ratchet. Just happy for progress. I love when I accidentally grab because he gives that little wave to me. <laughs> it's like, oh, I'm okay. <laughs> How are you doing? Oh. Uh, he's got a weird motion going on, but it's working. I don't know what muscle he's trying to work out, but it worked. Oh, but now I can't get it off. Is that normal? Is it? Is that meant to happen? Am I supposed to be using that big crane arm to assemble the uh, telescope rather than me kind of cheesing my way in through the door and nearly smushing my face? Because now that I think about it, that makes a lot of sense. But I like my way too. Okay, uh, risky maneuver of the day. Well, actually, there's been many of those, but yeah, I kind of bumped into this thing and nearly sent it out the window. I'm also just realizing that I took this off the platform thinking I was getting it out of my way. <laughs> and now that's where I need to put it back. Oh no, it got stuck and then, uh, you know what? Let me see if I can use this crane now anyway. Aha, I can. Oh, and it's actually, it's not like terribly awkward. Okay, maybe a little bit awkward. I'll tell you what it's less awkward than though. The solution I had come up with beforehand. <laughs> this thing is so awkward to move around. It's actually, very frustrating to move this thing about. Oh, that was so violent, but it fits so perfectly. All right, let's put it in before before it comes back out. That solar panel has a mind of its own. There. No, 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 no. Why is it always my head? Phew, that was slick. How can we be slick like that when you needed to sit on a seat? Oh, no, 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 no. That's not what we want. Okay. Open. No. Okay, it's still a little bit awkward. No, I hit the button. You're coming with me, solar panel. And I hit the button with that again. Okay, let's see if we can put this on, maybe? Oh no, that, that little thing I put on is kind of in the way. Maybe I can, yeah. Just kind of flung it at it. That solar panel is definitely broken. Oh no, I hit the button again and again. Oh, and now I have it. No, no, this is the opposite of what I want. I don't know how this has happened, but I, I, I've made it worse. This is Major Tom to ground control. I'm going in. <laughs> He's wiggling his way through it. Yeah. If you want something done right, you got to do it yourself. And with your regular, weirdly uncoordinated arms, not some giant robot arm. Oh, Putting it in with my feet just to show how confident I am. Oh my god, this is by far the most awkward part of the game. And I feel like it's self-imposed. Yes, I kind of just threw it in there, but it worked. 
just clipped itself on. No wonder the stuff keeps falling apart if that's how we assemble it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, wait. Wait. Move my legs. Move my legs. Oh, no. I'm, I'm ruining it. I'm ruining it. I'm ruining everything. Oh? Oh, my God. It nearly did it. Wait. It's doing it. <laughs> What? <laughs> okay, I think God is on my side for this one. Or maybe I was taking so long the game just started to feel sorry for me. I feel like I took a really long time for this one. Okay, open the manual. What, is that everything done? Unpack the cargo delivery. Oh, no. My legs keep getting in the way. I think I should just get rid of them. <laughs> Come on, just scrunch off. There you go. It's times like these where I'm lost and confused where I wish... I would just pay a little bit more attention sometimes to what the game is telling me what I need to do next. Like, I know I have to unpack cargo, but I don't know where. Okay, so it's behind this lever door. All right. I don't know if I wasn't able to open that earlier or maybe I was doing it wrong. I guess I wasn't able to. It's hard to know, really, with everything I've been through. I feel like I'm gaslighting myself somehow. Oh, no. Do I have to move this all the way across the ship? And I thought the solar panel was bad. Okay, I got it unhooked pretty easily. And now I think I'm just gonna hit it with my head for most of the movement. Now, the thing is, um, how am I supposed to open this? Oh, the crowbar. Yes, I remember the crowbar. I just wish I remember where I left it. Wait, oh, they tied the crowbar onto here. Why would they do that? It's the only thing in this thing that's actually tethered. I know why they do that just to piss me off. It's about me specifically. Oh no, I just realized there's roped off things that are in the way as well. Every time you think it's bad, it just gets worse. I sound really angry this game now. I'm not that angry. I'm just a little upset. <laughs> I look like a baby that wants uppies. I'm trying to flap my way in here. I don't want to disturb the box. Yes, it worked. So I'll disconnect this and just let them loose. And flail my arms, and I'm sure they'll move out of the way for me. Oh no, oh no, the only one that moved was the one I didn't want to move. Don't worry, I messed up so badly, it's actually bouncing back. There we go, I think we're clear. Now, little box, you're coming with me. Oh, the wrong way, apparently. No, you want to come this way. Okay, gently now. Gently, yeah. Gently. <laughs> gently. Gently. Okay. All right, I hope that thing's not fragile, like it says lens on it. Okay, all right. This is what I'm talking about. The only thing I kind of hate is that it's the wrong way, so I need to figure out how to turn it. Okay, I think I've managed it. I also kind of hit it outside of the room, but I'm trying to fix that as we speak, so don't worry. Now the crowbar is stuck behind the box. Now the box is upside down again. Okay, all right. We have both things at the right side. The question is, how exact do I have to be with this crowbar thing? I'm feeling pretty exact. <laughs> Come on. Come on, I'm getting it somehow. Come on! Yes, I did it! Oh, that was so difficult. I'm so glad I didn't lose that. I have created a roadblock for myself. <laughs> I have put the box lid in the way. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, don't go out there. That's not for you. I'm coming in there. I'm not letting this lens go. I worked too hard for this thing. Get me in. Oh, come on. Oh, God. Oh, God. I think I'm breaking it. I think I'm breaking the lens. Okay. I got out of there. That might be for the best. Maybe it'll, like, yeah, dismount itself. And then I can go through second. Oof, that was risky. I thought that's where it might all end. I think I just have a bit of space madness at this point. And I'm sure when we see how long it took me to do this level that we'll see why. You'll understand. You'll all understand. Come on, kick the button. I feel like you're doing this stuff to me all the time by accident. And now that I want you to kick the button, you won't kick the button. Okay, I'm through with great difficulty, but I'm through. Now I just need to put this over here. I think this part shouldn't be too bad. It doesn't look that awkward. In fact, I'm... I'm somehow doing it just through sheer brute force. There we go. And the magic floaty takes its effect and then I just get out of here, right? <gasps> Maybe I don't even have to crawl my way back. Or no, I do. That's what those controls are for. Okay. <laughs> Definitely not how that was supposed to be done, but it's the way we did it. <laughs> Let us never speak of it again. Okay, I've detached the hooks. Now do I need to just push it out of there with the, the crane arm? Here you go, you delicate little telescope. Off you go there now. Is this correct? <laughs> I feel like I'm smashing it into something. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely smashing it into something. But can I complete it like this? What if I just, like, let it bounce around a bit and then I try and open the door? Wait, did the crane arm just 
catch on to it again? Or did I not manage to let go of it? Oh, okay, so I must have hit the button and that detached the hooks. I didn't realize. I thought that was the lever doing that. Okay, here we go. Now just toss it up there into the sky. <laughs> sure coordinates aren't important or anything. Just get it out. Yeah, away you go there now. <laughs> I think it's gonna hit the door on the way out. Be free, my little baby. They grow up so fast. I wonder what country we're spying on. Well, I think old Tom has had enough of this life. He's just not got it. He flew out of there like a bird in a cage. He was eager to get away. <laughs> Godspeed, Tom. Godspeed. Thank you so much for giving me the space in your day to check out the video. You can check out more of my content here if you'd like to. But thank you very much for watching and subscribe if you're new. Hope to see you next time. Bye for now.